A heartbreaking story of an elderly Greensboro couple. They died within hours of each other. Two more lives cut short by COVID-19. The couples were married for nearly 70 years. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake learned more about their love story. Family of Ray and Barbara Coble told me the couple cherished others as much as each other, and they had a love story you only see in the movies. A family in mourning. We're kind of in heartache over here. After losing both parents in less than 24 hours. I can see the blessing in it. It's, it's hard. But it is, it is tough. Ray and Barbara Coble had a strong love that grew throughout their nearly 70 year relationship. They said to death to a They truly meant it. And that's kind of rare these days. Almost like a notebook ending the, uh, the way that it ended. And their love for each other over the years has just really taught us a lot. And we're trying to embrace that love, knowing that they're together again. Ray Coble was the brother of the late Congressman Howard Coble. WFMY sat down with Ray almost seven years ago, where his dedication to his brother was apparent. I've always been very comfortable and satisfied to be the other brother. I've always been proud of him. Just like his dedication to his wife their entire lives, even more so after she was diagnosed with dementia. He was so dedicated that he would not sleep in a bed. He wanted to sleep in a recliner so he could be as close to her in the next room as he possibly could. Even writing her this poem, ending it with saying, quote, There are many, many things to share about our wedded life, but most of all I want to say, I'm proud you're still my wife. Memories the Coble children will forever cherish. And my family, move. Like dancing with their dad and finding this telegram from Barbara to Ray while he was fighting in the Korean War, telling him they had their first baby boy. Now leaving behind a legacy for their daughter, three sons, ten grandchildren, and nine great grandchildren. God was a cornerstone of, of that relationship, without a doubt. Mom and Dad would both tell you that life was not always easy, and um, but they stuck together and the support that they had for each other. Support for each other and their children, who will take some lasting advice from their father's poem. Quote, from time to time, the ship of life has no wind to fill its sail, but always believe that later, a fresh wind will make it swell. In Greensboro, Amber Lake, WFMY News 2.